Okay, look, I'm gonna do everything I can to stop Nico, but if something goes wrong, take this, you point, pull the trigger, okay? You don't have to be real accurate when you aim shot. I think I can take care of myself, Jason. Well, you're tough, huh? What, are you making fun of me? Well, I think the recoil would throw you across the... <laughs> Contrary, your baby is trying to show itself. We've got the perfect position to determine gender. Do you want to know? It's up to you. I don't know. Yeah, I, yes, yes, <laughs> I'm dying to know. Who am I well, kidding? I am happy to be the one to tell you. Congratulations, parents. You're having a baby girl. <laughs> Are you disappointed? Uh, about what? I don't know. Maybe you wanted a boy or something. No, no. I like, uh, I like the idea of, you know, a girl. I just don't... I just don't know much about them. Obviously, you know, Michael and Morgan, I know boys. The way you were with Michael today... I think that's all you need to know how to do. And if I can manage to do the same, I really do think this little girl will be okay. I get a chicken. For us to give this baby a loving and stable home. Yes. Yes. Okay, great. Then we need to communicate. Uh, we do. You do most of it. <sighs> About something deeper than if I've taken my vitamins or how late you're going to be working. We need to tell each other how we feel. Like if we're sad or upset, we need to help each other through Look, it. Uh, you, you just need to take care of yourself, take care of the baby, eat, sleep, and avoid stress. Well, it stresses me out to see you so angry. You're about to put your fist through a wall. Well, I'm not angry. You were. Well, I got over it all by myself. I don't need to talk about it. What is so wrong with wanting to help you? You have seen me through the toughest time of my life. If emotional sport were monetary, I would be in debt, I don't know, let's see, thousands of dollars. And I'd given you what, 50 cents? Okay, you, you really want to help? Just stop asking how I feel. You want to talk about someone? Let's talk about the baby. Or the weather, or nothing. Fine, fine. You win. For today. Because the weather's good, the baby's good. And now I haven't eaten lunch yet. 
Why didn't you tell me? I would have made you something. I will do it. I'm going to take off my shoes. I'm going to be barefoot, pregnant, in the kitchen, exactly the way you like your women. On second thought, I'll cook. I was, te I was teasing. Come on. I, I know. Okay. Well, then a good way to show that you get a joke is to smile or something. Laugh. Now, I'm serious, Jason. Children model their parents' behavior. And suppose she, she grows up and she doesn't know how to smile. Do you really want to be responsible for a humor-impaired child? No, I don't think so. You need practice. Lots of practice. Oh. Where your girl? Annie Michelle, my fourth granddaughter. Wow. You know, I'm, I'm having a girl, too, and I cannot wait. You make sure you and your husband enjoy this time together, because once that baby comes, you won't have time for anything else. Yeah, well, I, I don't think that's going to be a problem for me. I take it you're not married. <laughs> I realize it's the going trend to have a baby on your own, but... A child needs a father. If you can't provide one, you shouldn't get pregnant. Hey, there you are. Been looking all over for you. Where's your wedding ring? You didn't lose it, did you? I left it on the kitchen sink. Oh. You forgive me? Always. My apologies, young lady. I jumped to the wrong conclusion. My husband and I are, are too happy to be angry. Best of luck to you both. Thank you. Traveled all over the place. Where'd you like the best? Uh, I'd say um, the best place I've traveled is not the best place I've been. All right, I need to hear about this. That sounds spiritual. Well, when Michael was a baby, um, son was gone. I was living in his place, and I used to. Just stand with Michael, looking out the window and just talking to him until he fell asleep. Talking to him about what? Uh, anything, um, traveling, boats, what the park looked like in the summer. I mean, obviously he didn't care what I said. He just needed to hear my voice and feel me holding him. After a while, he'd, uh, you know, he'd fall asleep and... I would just stand there with him, listening to him breathe, knowing he felt safe. That's the best place I've ever been. Well, if you think about it, in a couple of weeks, you'll be holding her, talking to her. Yeah, that should be interesting, huh? Hearing you talk for a change. Well, babies have different personalities. Maybe she'll want to hear your horrible singing. Oh, no, I am not. Well, she wants to hear me sing. I will sing. I want her to have everything. Jason, I want her to have lullabies and soccer practices, slumber parties, horseback riding lessons, you know, everything that I never had. And from now on, that's what my life is about. Bringing up a happy child. <laughs> Listen, I can't believe I'm actually saying this, but I am so excited to have this baby. And I don't mean just to have her and just have her here. I'm at the actual birth itself. 
Mm. I don't know. Maybe it's my hormones. Maybe it's all the birthing classes. Okay, well, maybe, but you have to at least go once with me if you're going to be there in the delivery I, you know, room. I still no, think don't I... say Emily, please. I'm begging you. You got to do it. You got to be there. Unless, of course, you're scared. That I... Scared of all... I don't know. I have to do all the work. It's not but like you...